Russia throwing freshly mobilized soldiers into a salt grinder near Kupiansk. In the Kupiansk direction, Russian forces form assault teams out of soldiers drafted only a month ago while the intensity of enemy assault efforts periodically drops as Ukrainian troops keep repelling attacks. That's according to Ola Sini Hubov, the chief of the Kharkiv Regional Military Administration. Fierce battles rage there every day. We periodically observe a decrease in the enemy's offensive intensity, but this is because our armed forces inflict significant damage on them in terms of weapons, military equipment, and manpower. Of course, they bring in their reserves, including to the Kupiansk Axis. We know these military units. Some of them were mobilized only a month ago, but they are already part of assault troops. We understand that attempts to storm the Kupiansk direction continue. There, the enemy constantly employs aviation, guided aerial bombs, including against civilian settlements, people, private households, and industrial facilities. Our armed forces perceive all this adequately, of course so they also build up their forces in a way to effectively deter the enemy," Senegubov said. He noted that the Russian army in the specified direction conducts rotations in accordance with the military situation. The rotation takes place constantly, they react to the military situation they see developing in the south and in the north including in the Kupiansk direction. Therefore, they do not ease their pressure. It eases only because it is necessary to replace the units that have suffered significant losses before continuing their assault efforts, said the administration head. 